in this video, we're gonna get back with the BP-50 Assault Rifle here in Modern Warfare 3. I dropped not one, not two, but three MGB nukes with this class. I know for a fact a lot of you guys are going to enjoy. It has zero recoil and you're gonna be beaming MCW and Hulker 556 players across the map. If you guys enjoy, feel free, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn those notifications. Let's go ahead and get into the class setup. Let's go ahead and create the new absolute best and fastest killing BP-50 class setup. If you're looking for a very solid assault rifle, you can use that medium range. I got you guys covered. For the first attachment, we are going to run a muzzle and we are going to be suppressing the BP-50. I enjoy this weapon with the Shadow Strike Suppressor, which is going to take us off the radar, which is a massive W. If you're looking to get behind the enemy team, build up a quick and easy streak and drop your first MGB nuke, which I know a lot of you guys are trying to get done. Now, we are going to run a barrel on this setup as well, and the Lore 9 Heavy Barrel is phenomenal. This is going to be bumping up our bullet velocity and range, our gun kick control, our recoil control, and firing aiming stability. The BP-50's recoil pattern is very weird, so we want to have it so it just shoots straight up. That's it. So it's very easy to control. Definitely a mandatory attachment on this assault rifle if you want to use it and compete against other MCW and Holger 556 users. We are going to run an underbarrel on this build, and the Bruin Heavy support grip is going to be the best to run to completely smooth out that recoil pattern this is a mandatory attachment on this setup because we need to mitigate a lot of that wobble the bp50 has man we're gonna have gun kick control aim idle sway horizontal recoil control as well as firing aiming stability this is a great attachment like i said if you're trying to have a laser beam ar now, we are not going to run a magazine on this build. Sometimes I recommend running the 45 round mag on the BP-50, but this is going to be the no recoil setup, which I know a lot of you guys are going to be looking for. For the rear grip, we are going to be rocking the grip tape. This is going to be a great option going ahead and bumping up even more recoil control, gun kick control, and more firing aiming stability. Again, this weapon has a very weird recoil pattern. We want to go ahead and remove a lot of that as much as possible and then finally we are going to be running a stock on this build and i do recommend running the more 40 stock this is going to be going ahead and increasing more of that recoil control as well as gun kick aim down sight speed and aim walking speed so we have the best of both worlds here close range as well as long range this is a mandatory attachment on any and all bp50 setups once you jump into the firing range, you're going to see here this is going to be a phenomenal class setup because we still have a respectable ADS even though we have nothing but recoil controlling attachments and we are going to be able to go full auto across the map without worrying about a thing. That's why I do like this assault rifle and a nice way to go ahead and break up the meta. We are going to rock the Core 45 with its conversion kit, essentially transforming it into a submachine gun. We do have on the 40 round drum here. We're gonna be utilizing the SO Skeletal Vertical Grip. We have on the Colossus Suppressor, the XS version for more recoil control. And we do have on the XRK Dynamic Precision Stock, courtesy of the conversion kit, a nice attachment here. Now, do not forget to run Munitions Box, Scavenger Gloves, Covert Sneakers, Bone Conduction Headset to hear footsteps and gunfire a lot easier, Ghost TV Camera to keep you off the radar, as well as the Comms Vest, which is going to act like a 24-7 UAV. Every time you kill somebody, run for the body, they're dropping a radar beacon, letting you know where everybody is at. And because the spawns are so bad, I got punished in both gameplays. You're going to be able to know where people are at. Definitely a nice vest to have definitely a good bp50 setup do not sleep on it it's going to be a contender against the mcw as well as the holger 556 so if you guys are trying to tear it up whew, give this a go if you enjoy feel free drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel turn those post notifications let's go ahead and get into the gameplays man all right let's get busy with the bp50 it's been a minute since i've ran this assault rifle very fun to use it reminds me of the bow 27 from advanced warfare i don't know why it just does but we're actually getting that assault rifle for season three of this game which is pretty cool in my personal opinion let's see if they go ahead and keep it exactly how it was in aw they probably are because in the fact that sledgehammer games did both advanced warfare and this game so it's going to be probably a copy and paste just like how this is a copy and paste from literally the f2000 aka bp50 from vanguard
Oh. Do you lose? Oh my god. Teammates, where are you? Got a veto. Where did he go? Rotate this way. Copy. Advanced UAV entering the AO. Weeping for threat. See, this is what's irritating. Is it he's definitely just crouch walking around the corner? Oh no, he wasn't. He's actually trying to snipe. Oh my god. Hold on. Go, baby. SVA 545? I mean, I guess? Drop this VTO. Solid copy, Phoenix 23 on station. Scanning for hostiles. Round 21. Move to the hard point. They're starting to back out. Bro. This is literally why the comms vest is so damn important. Why are they still spawning over here? Like. On a brutal piece, they're literally still. Rotate over here. Oh my God, who is dropping the smoke? Enemies inside the perimeter. We've secured the lead. 
Locating. Stand by. You're kidding me, I died a real slime, dude. Like, look, what are you, what are you protecting playing like this? He, 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 he moved to a different corner. Oh my God. Somebody's running that jack barrel. Yeah, this is good, this AMR9. Really stupid running that barrel on this map. The thing is that barrel in theory it's a good idea to use because it removes a lot of the recoil but you really are just giving yourself up Nobody's over here just popping up on the radar. Hard point relocated. Secure oh, there's VTOL jet. Middle map again. Oh, give me that advanced. We have time for another one, for real. You gotta keep them spawning around me though. That's the thing. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Let's go we got it <laughs> double let's go with a beep beep fitty this one i heard somebody coming this way let's go baby double and we got three kills with it let's get it Right, let's get busy on scrapyard with the bp50 i haven't played scrapyard in a very very long time i almost forgot this was in the rotation i've been getting a lot of like the modern warfare 2 maps recently which well you guys know what i mean i'm not really upset about that at all i really do like playing those maps but it's nice to go ahead and kind of return back to 
you know, the maps that this game shipped with. Hold on, hold on. Honestly, feels like there's not a full team. It sucks that 10v10 is unplayable. Okay, hold on. I just completely just botched that. One second. There we go. I end up shooting his claymore. How funny is that? Come on, man. Where they at? Hard point relocated. Secure the top. Enemies inside the perimeter. Wait, what? Was that an enemy? Dude, his name tag was not... There's a guy trying to snipe. His name tag was not popping up. I'm backing out of that. Shit. Yeah, they're already in the hill. I don't think I have a team. I literally don't have a team. Kidding me, he Your block. Enemy UAV active. Got a VTOL jet. Enemies inside the perimeter. Drop that over there. Copy that. Phoenix 2 3 is on the station. Go for tasking. Target area updated. Twenty four. Hard point compromised. 
28. Come on, man. One kill. All right, we got it. We literally just one man army this shit. I thought there was a guy behind me. Thank you for that MCW. I'm going to wait till they get to like 245 and call it. <laughs> It over here. Hard I mean, relocated. Secure the target area. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. In all reality, well, it's highly unlikely we can get a double. Forgetting his heart. Advanced. Copy. Advanced UAV entering the AO. Sweeping for threat. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. I need to drop this. What's your buck? It's possible. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Advanced UAV returning to base. 18. Enemies inside. Possible. Confirming next hard point. Stand by. Should have known the guy was walking up a oh my god To teammate, did he sp did they spawn one guy behind. They did, yep. Nuke time. They literally just put one guy behind us just to get the revenge kill. That's actually crazy. That's actually crazy. They put one guy behind us just so we can get the revenge kill on us. That's actually insane. But it's all good because we got the nuke. All good. It got zero kills. But we got the nuke, which secured us that W. Well, we're going to win anyway, which is an even bigger W.